Shalom. We are the Hebrew Israelites. First and foremost, we're going to give all praises to Yahweh Ba Shem Yahweh Shai. Okay. All praise to Yahweh Ba Shem Yahweh Shai. Double honor to the apostles, the elders of GMS who rule well. Okay. Double honor to the apostles, to the elders of GMS who rule well. Rock a thumb now, you Akim, that's out for clear, pushing this truth, the sincerity and the strength of Yahweh Ba Shem Yahweh Shai. Okay. We are here for the elect of the 12 tribes of Israel, due to the so called Negroes. Benjamin, the so-called West Indian Jamaicans, Levi, the so-called Haitians, Reuben, the so-called Seminole Indians, Gad, the so-called North American Indians. We are here for Issachar, the so-called Mexican Indians, Zebulon, Guatemala to Panama, Manasseh, the so-called Cubans, Ephraim, the so-called Puerto Rican, Simeon, the so-called Dominican, um, Naphtali, uh, Argentina, Chile, and Asher, Colombia to Uruguay. These are the 12 tribes of Israel who Yahweh Shai is coming to redeem. One third the elect. The two thirds are set up for this destruction, man. You know, that hey, ain't. And this is this is a you know, for the men of the Lord, man, we, we this is a beautiful time to be prophesying in the highways and byways, man, because America is about to be destroyed, man. Uh and most ticky die, man. Soon, sooner, sooner than you think, man, it's coming. It's closer than when we first believed. And it's coming, man. You can see it, man. They primed and ready, man. You know? This is uh, Jeremiah 3 and 15. And I will give you pastors according to my heart, which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding. Read that again. It says, Jeremiah 3 and 15. I will give you pastors according to my heart which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding so the men of the lord you see out here pushing this truth and the sincerity and truth in the name of Yahweh Yahushua he said we bring you pastors according to his heart according to his mind according to his ways according to his his knowledge and these men have understanding of these scriptures because a lot of people claim to be pastors they don't they, they they don't have the faith in Yahweh Bashem Yahusha. They don't know Yahweh Bashem Yahusha. They don't know the prophecies that, that are that are uh, coming that are this past and that are coming. It's certain men, man. Mainly GMS. And you have a small amount of men that's outside of GMS who push the truth in the name and in faith and sincerity. You know? Uh this Jeremiah chapter two. Verse 33, why trimmest thou thy ways to seek love? Because that's what these pastors do. Look up that word trimmer in Jeremiah 2, uh, 2 33. Yeah, why trimmest, let me read that again. This Jeremiah 2 and uh, 33. Why trimmest thou thy ways to seek love? Therefore, Hast thou also taught the wicked ones thy ways? God. Tremors, that's a Hebrew 3190. That Hebrew word is yatab. Yatab. Uh, to, to be, to make well, literally, figuratively, happy, successful, right. To be accepted of men. Use a right. Benefit. Be better. Seem best. Make cheerful. Uh, blue letter to be good be pleasing be well be glad to to be joyful to be in a well place to rejoice yeah to be pleasing unto men so that's what you're trying to do uh that's why that's why the brother read the scriptures the most high will raise up uh prophets that will be uh, according to his heart because the men of the lord are gonna be according to the to the heavenly father in his son heart like a brother was breaking down okay but you got these false pastors which are set up and lead israel astray and they not telling you the full truth just to fit in with society and trying not to offend you you see that's what they set up to do they trying not to offend you and keep as many as people uh in their congregation as possible so they can continue making money off of them because it's all a racket that, that, that Christianity madness, Roman Catholic madness, that's all a racket, basically, uh, uh, to make money off 
the uh, Negro Latinos and Native Americans because you got a lot of uh, uh, Hispanics, so-called Hispanics, in that Roman Catholic Church. So the Negroes that, that call themselves so-called pastors in them churches, what they doing is not telling the truth, trying not to offend them so they can fit in with them and be pleasing to them. But the Heavenly Father said in Isaiah uh, uh, 51, I mean 58 and 1, lift up thy voice like a trumpet and tell my people their transgression. So you're not going to uh, 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 trim the word in order to be, in order to fit in, in order to please the masses of Israel. Because Israel are, are stiff-necked people. They got to be told straightforward, man. And that's what the Heavenly Father have set the prophets up to do. That's why you got uh, Jeremiah uh, 28 and 8. That's why you got that in there. You see? All right. Come on. Micah 3 and 10. The heads thereof judge for reward, and the priests thereof teach for hire, and the prophets thereof divine for money. Yet will they learn upon the Lord Yahweh and say, Is not the Lord Yahweh amongst us? None evil come upon us. So it say they, they preach for reward and for hire because them 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 same pastors every 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 um Sunday right every Wednesday they 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 get together in them harlot houses and they take up them collections man and them offers you know they'll take them up and they take up extra they got different names for it then if you if you call one of them so called past pastors to come preach in your town you gotta pay them man you know you gotta pay them but the real men of the lord we out here we out here in truth and sincerity man and having faith in y'all about shim y'all shy we not charging nobody to come out here scripture tell you uh was it by the uh by the truth and sell it not by the truth and sell it not come come so we out here man we out here we out here doing this man for to try to make it up out of here, man. This this is not a game, man. We don't we don't look for no uh, monetary uh, funds for this going. You know? And even with that, man, that's why these so-called pastors are gonna be destroyed. That's why Yahweh Bashem Yahushai is gonna destroy America, man. Because America is way past wicked, man. It's at the height of its wickedness, man. It's so wicked around here, man. They got the people blinded. They so comfortable. They don't know what's going on, man. I mean, these people are really, really sleeping. Yeah, this Proverbs 23 and 23. Buy the truth and sell it not. Also wisdom and instruction and understanding. Come, buy the truth and sell it not, man. That's what that's what that's what them pastors do. That's you even have uh Nate Satan do the same thing, man. Come. Sell, selling you uh starter kits and whatnot. Uh, selling you headbands with your name on it, your Hebrew name on it. Yeah, he's the he's the one that's trimming, that's trimming, it, trimming the word, you no. know, to please to please the masses of Israel and the so-called please the so-called white man, because that's what we're working for. God. He's not working to uh, to uh, to uh, uplift Israel. He working to please the white man and to please the so-called uh, nigger woman. That's what he's doing. God. You know, that's what he's doing. And then uh, Yahana. They doing the same thing, man. They been paid off, man. So the real men of the Lord, hey, we're gonna do this because of the fear of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai, man. And what he said was, was gonna happen if you don't. And that's why we out here, man. We out here to wake up the elect of the 12 tribes of Israel. You know? This, uh, this, uh, Jeremiah uh, 6 and 30. Reprobate silver shall shall men call them because the Lord had rejected them. Okay. You see, so all them pastors that's uh, uh, that's trimming the word, basically to be uh, to be uh, pleasing to the people just to fit in. Uh, when the heavenly Father uh, deliver the nation of Israel and elect out of him, because you're gonna have women amongst that that get delivered. That's with the man. 
that's with the man of the Lord. And we're going to be looking at them as reprobate silver, just like we look at them right now. Lord willing, we're the men. Done. When they're getting destroyed. Reprobate, uh, Hebrew 39:88. my os to reject, to despise, to refuse. Right? Yeah, that's the word reprobate, right? Reprobate, right? Done. Yeah, Jeremiah, Jeremiah 6 and 30, that's what he's definition is. So, the way he, the brother did, explained, beautiful, man. You look up that definition. Yeah, read that definition. Come. And I'll read the scripture. Hold on. The Jeremiah 6 and 30. Reprobate silver shall men call them because the Lord had rejected them. Come. It says, Hebrew 39, 88. My os, to reject, to despise, to refuse, to abhor, to cast away, to condemn, to disdain. To melt away, reject, reprobate, vile persons. Yeah, you reject it, man. You know, this uh, Jeremiah 7 and uh, 4. Trust ye not in lying words, saying the temple of the Lord, the temple of the Lord, the temple of the Lord are these. All them churches. Mm -hmm. You see, you got churches on every corner. Study talking about just the house of the Lord. Yeah. My saying, father's house and all that. Saying that you holier than thou. Huh. You see? Meaning you holier than the most high and you don't got no sin. You holier than y'all bought you and I was shy and you don't have no sin. That's what you're doing when you uh 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 saying that. This uh Isaiah 30 and 10, which say to the seers, see not, and say to the prophets, prophesy unto us right thing, and speak unto us smooth thing and prophesy deceit. Son, so you want to hear that smooth talk? The way they be talking. That's what y'all want to hear. Yeah, and never break down the scripture. Yeah. Go to, go to Mark 7 9, and then he'll go into a story about when he was a little boy riding a donkey on a, in, in, in the, in the cornfield and shit. And then make you feel good. And then the little boy on the damn drums and hit them drums. And then that organ will go off. And then there y'all go jumping around and shit. Like little demons and shit. You know? Like you said, ain't nail scripture been broke down. You know? Never. <laughs> but with the men, GMS, hey, like you said, hey, we're gonna go into the word, we're gonna give you the truth, we're gonna give you the understanding, we're gonna break the words down. And if you can't understand it from that, then it's not for you. Just plain as that. This John 6 and 39. As, as this is the Father which has sent me, that all that that of all which had given me, I shall lose nothing, but shall raise it up again at the last day. So you got the men of the Lord being raised up, and the elect not going to be uh, uh, lost from Yahweh Shemel was shot. You see? They're going to feed you. They're going to feed you according to the knowledge and wisdom and understanding of the scriptures, man. And do what's pleasing to the heavenly father, not what's pleasing to men and try to fit in, man. You know, and lie to you and try to, and try to, uh, and try to, uh, uh, use the teachings of Yahweh Shem Abishai as a racket to get money off of you. You know? Right. We want out of here, man. We want out of here, man. We, we hate this place, man. Everybody proud and way past wicked, man. Everybody in this place proud, man. Everybody in America proud. Throughout the whole world, they all proud, man. They don't have understanding. They don't understand uh, that the Heavenly Father is bringing back righteousness on the earth, man. Bringing back that balance through the men. Because you ain't got nothing but wickedness on the earth. That's all you got, man. And these people don't understand that, man. God. These average, average people that's walking around don't understand it. That's why we always tell you it's for the elect, man, out of the Negro, Latinos, and Native Americans. So that's who the Father, the Heavenly Father and His Son, is uh, uh, searching for not a uh, Joe six Joe average six pack that ain't got the spirit of Yahweh Shem I was shot in him, man. Right. Most high don't want him. You see, John, uh, John ten and twenty six. It says, "But ye believe not, because ye are not of my sheep, as I said unto you. My sheep hear my voice, and I know them, and they follow me. Huh? And they follow him. You see." Whatever the Heavenly Father uh, 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 say according to the scriptures, they gonna do what these scriptures say in the spirit of Yahweh Shem Shai. They ain't gonna follow no stranger that's trimming and trimming this word and trying and teaching contrary to the Heavenly Father just to please the masses, saying everybody can be saved. You see? 
and I give unto them eternal life. Eternal life. What's that? That's the tree of life. Having the balance, having the balance of wickedness and having the balance of uh, righteousness. Because that's what's going to happen when you get the uh, uh, eternal life. You're going to be able to live a thousand years and you're going to understand the difference between righteousness and, and wickedness. That's why, that's why you got examples of the so-called white man, him being the devil on the earth, so you can recognize what's wicked on the earth and judge between that. So that's eternal life, being able to judge like that and having it and, and living a thousand years. You know? Come. That's part of the tree of life. Well, that is the tree of life. You know? And I will give unto them eternal life, mm -hmm. and they shall never perish. They shall never perish. They're gonna be translated, living a thousand years, and they're gonna be translated into the heavens, man. You see? Neither shall any man pluck them out of my hand. That's that, man. You ain't on. You ain't on. Uh, uh, Esau's not gonna be able to look up the word pluck. Esau's not gonna be able to. Uh, uh, well, we gonna look it up. Look up the word sure. pluck. God. 